Hey, your team. Ooh. Ooh. Beloy special. Yikes. Slow. Okay. It's a slow resistance, though. I mean, there's more movement speed for Geek, so they can really out-rotate RRQ. But at the same time, I guess they're really still banking on the EX to be the main playmaker for the Rafael land. So this means, like, still a lot of speed boost, more uh, mobility for the Irritel. This match. Oh my god! What? Whoa, 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 whoa. What wow. the hell? Wow, what is going on? Okay. okay. <laughs> what is going on indeed? All right. <laughs> Where is this Popo? It's for Skyler. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My deal damage, but just like that, we're into the land of dawn. Land of dawn. Geek fam's chance to the upper brackets. But Rashi, Popo and Koopa, the buffs onto this hero has been, Moonsong's been very specific about the buffs. It's onto jungle creeps, right? Exactly. What's so up with this pick in the gold lane? I think it's just value when it comes to survivability, etc. Oh. Baloisky, though, oh. Flicker. Flicker hasn't been able to fully go into the stuns and to bully this Irithel. Let's take a look at the turtle. First take and Nile going at it. 50 50 coming in. Banana comes in with the Petrify, but Nile still finds it. That's a rough wave. Spare six going to be slain by a boy. If I salivating, like on the. Uh, potential of their wilderness dressing my butt. Oh! Dressing another engage! A big dive into a wave with a dragon by Naomi! Jadera gets out, heavy cross, but outplays Skyler! The first thing taunted up under the turret, takes a big turret shot and straight into the blades of Nile. Nile! That's the first skill to get away as Nile, very aggressive once again. Knocked up, Naomi walking down, the Requiem locks him down. Who gets it? Was it first sick? Yes, it was. Now it's an all-in <laughs> onto the Hydra. No movement at all. And a Petrify as well. Beloisky caught in the final slash. And now it might just be a boy getting caught, but he has a rough way to escape. Naomi follows him through with the Jeekun Do. RRQ is just saving up, and now Luke becomes victim of it again. Another Requiem locking Luke down. Beautifully done. And RRQ has just... <laughs> Reclaimed. Especially if Geek Fam sticks together and Nile can soak in the damage. Holy Baptism, Nile in the back as well, pinching Skyler down. This might be a solo kill. Boy, the dragon locking Nile on the wall with a heavy Watch crossbow. Jadera needs one more hit. Clay in the back jumps in with the Oddity. Jadera still able to escape. The Petrify locks him down. No Purify right now, but he's still able to escape for now. And Clay splashes him with water as that's an amazing no. ram into a raging sandstorm from Geek Fam. They pick up a tier two and a two for one trade. Khalid. So he can go for a split push if necessary, Ooh. and he can definitely deal damage Ooh. unless Fair Signal gets jumped on. First six has been locked down twice. Nile cancels the jump twice, and Beloy was able to catch him with a holy baptism. Play jumps in right now, rough waves, but Beloy is able to heal back up with a good purify as well. To there with a heavy crossbow earlier. Naomi looking for the pick onto Luke, but Nana jumping in with a phantom slash, but now locked down. Has the eye for an eye, but it's gonna be Beloy who picks up the kill. A boy steals the final blow. Now backing away, RRQ in full defense mode. They've lost two members, and a base turret is going to follow next. Geek Pam takes oh. it, Luke diving deep. Clay forced to use a defensive oh. but Luke slashes him down in the back. Not even traded out. Nile walking to the front right now, getting locked out with the Requiem, and that's gonna be a kill back for RRQ. We go to defense, but Geek Pam are going on the base. They are ruthless in this game. They'll take no prisoners. As they take game one with them too. 11 minutes, not even 11 minutes for Geek Fam to defeat the, the royalties of the game. They won the upper bracket and they are trying to do it right now. On his feet, escapes from it, but RRQ, they want to try and get something to oh. make it punish for it. Versic locked down by the taunt right now. The Holy Baptism locked down as well. The penalty zone onto four by Banana, but Janera is still able to escape. Beloy will fall as Skyler gets the hard guard to help him. Look at Naomi on top of him. I've never seen this before, by the way. The Angela HP bar hovering over Skyler. The yeah. first battle of the turtle versus first six still pushes on the tempo. And they're going for Banana this time around. Look at the damage. Holy Baptism forced to be committed. Banana is just walking them down, getting some healing as well as the heavy spin comes out. And Versic this time is able to secure it for the team. Nile escaping, Luke getting some HP, but now gets bonked by the hammer of Banana. He jumps in in desperation. Doing a lot better right now, still ahead in gold. Compared to Kadera, Kadera, but now oh, he gets jumped on. Holy Baptism, but that's a DPC to peel them off. Beautifully done by Banana. A raging sandstorm stolen by Clay with IMU. The Skyler just guns them Ooh. down. A boy's next to the chopping block. The focusing oh. block blocks him down. He walks out of the map with the Astral Recon. Naomi's not able to find the final shot. Angela, it's what we saw, man. Bro.
It's so brutal. Oh, and now wow. they're trying to go for a boy. We'll see it brutal again. <laughs> Skyler just walks up without a care in the world because he always has that hard guard. So, fam, what they need to be careful of is Bananas Peel and also his engage. What an engage into a Rage Sandstorm, but Luke finds the back leg, gets punished. Jadero now pinned down to the wall with a heavy crossbow. Has the oh. healing from Beloisky, is able to outplay the situation as Banana gets shot down by the footballs of Chadera. Advantage to waste the resource of RQ might be the way to go, but Niall. Heavy spin into a heavy oh. crossbow. Skyler with a hard guard now helped down. Niall with a three-man taunt. Able to go in for the appraiser's round, but it's dodged away from by Skyler, who's now walking him down. Beloisky looking for the healing, but it's not enough. Luke finds the raging no sandstorm into the sphere. Skyler gets shut down. Chadera free hitting in the back right now, taking Clay out. Banana with a penalty zone in the front. Beloisky still able to survive. Now, 3v3. Chadera walking up. The Dragon Warrior is getting shut down by Chadera and the boy. Walking out, dashing away. Naomi providing some solid healing. Who won? I think RRQ definitely won right there. Getting the objective, making sure that they can force Geekfam into 5v5s once more. They're trying to go for the mid turret. We'll get it as well. Hives at all and just wait for the next floor. There's it go. Holy Baptism locked down. Astro Echo as well. Fairsick holding on to the heavy spin because he knows there's a hard guard to help him. Not to world, he's Luke. still that Luke! Oh, he misses it! The heavy spin locks him back down. Nile now pinned down, but RQ decides to run more. away. Geek fam decide to try to Ooh. chase. But in the end, they do not want to commit. Maybe with a bit more of that holy healing, with a bit more poke. HP and Geek fam have the top lane cleared out. That's a holy baptism locking him down. Verisic waiting for the heavy spin. Now pins Niall down, but he's gonna get too low. The Astro Echo comes down with the appraisers. Brad the Retry as well. Banana in the back as the Raging Sandstorm gets used up defensively. Niall gonna be locked down and taken out. RQ getting a one for zero. Clay gets caught in the holy baptism and even an Astral Sphere. One for one, Lord for kill. Now they can decide to completely commit to take a tier two down. Astral Spheres just dodged away from by RRQ. They're dealing with the Lord quite well. The Holy Lord oh. next though. Skyler taking low Luke in the back, but he's not able to find it. Skyler still has the hard guard. He's able to sustain with the help of a heavy spin from Fairsick. And that's two for RRQ. For me, this might be the exact situation that RRQ have been waiting for. But there's Good no hard guard. It's risky, but they're going for it. Ooh. Oh, he misses, but that misses, oh. but Chidera misses the flicker as well. Now, able to flicker out of the wall right there. That's what's going on the world. He, into the rage, he says, Storm, but Versic saves the team. Not for long. Chidera gets them all with no hard guard. RRQ fall one by one. It's a double for Chidera. Welcome to Geek's Chad era. Four for one. Sometimes you just gotta have luck on your side, man. The Lord was the MVP on that team fight. And right now, the Lord doesn't matter whatsoever. Kick Fam is trying to end the game right here, right now. It's only Naomi. How is Naomi going to defend this on an Angela? It's an Astral Echo. It's everything at the kitchen sink thrown at our kill. Kick Fam's hopes and dreams of the upper brackets is still alive. Oh. What did you see Arashi at that time? The Lord just knocks up four people of RQ, like three people in the air. And look, knowing that the Lord is on their side, just responded beautifully on their raging sandstorm. Green of nature, doesn't matter. Hardcore, doesn't matter. Which is, there's just way too much things to deal with at that point.